Welcome learners. Today we will look at the uh, topic of chemical families, pattern properties, a continuation of previous subtopic which was alkali metals. Previously we looked at the trend in properties of alkali metals which include atomic radius, we looked at uh, conduct cutting and also we looked at melting point. Today we want to look at two properties and there is ionization energy and reactivity of alkali metals. Now the first thing we should look at under uh, ionization energy is definition of this term here. Now this one is the minimum amount of energy required to remove the outermost energy level of electrons of an atom in its gaseous state. Now secondly look at the amount of energy required to remove the electrons in the outermost level of an alkali metal depends always on the size of the atom and strength of the nuclear attraction to the outermost energy level electrons. That is to say, when the atom is smaller, the outermost energy level electrons are strongly attracted by the nucleus and not easily lost. So it means they require more energy to remove the electrons. Now, when the atom is larger, the outermost energy level electron is weakly attracted by the nucleus and easily lost. So it means that it requires less amount of energy to remove the electrons. Now, if you're told compare the amount of energy required to remove the electron in sodium and lithium, you say ionization energy, ionization energy of sodium is less than that of lithium because the atom radius of sodium is large and its outermost energy level electron is weakly attracted and is lost. Now, when you, when you come to trends in, you say, ionization energy of alkali metals decreases down the group. Reason? As the size of the atom increases, the strength of the nuclear attraction to the outermost energy level electrons decreases. Now, the next property is the activity of alkali metals, which will help us to discuss the chemical properties of alkali metals. Here, reactivity depends on the size of the atom and ease of losing the outermost energy level electrons. Now, that is to say, when the atom is smaller, the outermost electron is not easily lost because it is strongly attracted by the nucleus. You can also say when the atom is smaller, the atom is less electropositive. Now, vice versa for that becomes when the atom is larger, the outermost electron is weakly attracted by the nucleus and is lost, so it becomes more reactive. So when I'm comparing the reactivity of two metals like lithium and potassium, I'll say lithium is less reactive than potassium because the lithium atom is smaller and does not easily lose electrons because the outermost electron is strongly attracted by the nucleus. You can also say the atom of lithium is smaller and less electropositive. Now, when it comes to trend in the activity of alkali metals down the group, we'll say the activity of alkali metals increases down the group. Reason? As the size of the atom increases, ease of losing electrons increases. We can also say as the size of the atom increases, electropositivity increases. Learners, that is the end of the lesson. In the next lesson, we'll discuss the chemical properties of alkali metals, that is the reaction with water, reaction with air, and the reaction with dilute acids. Thank you. Subscribe and share.